Welcome to the AOC CU34G2 XP Gaming Monitor Setup Tutorial. In this tutorial, we'll show you how to set up your AOC Gaming Monitor. Let's get started. Let's see what we have inside the box. First, we have the monitor itself. Next, we have the base. Following that, we have the stand. And then we have the USB up to USB A cable. Next, we have the display port cable. And following that, we have the HDMI cable. We have the power cable. And then we have the quick start guide, which is handy for setup. Let's connect the stand and base to the monitor. First, we will lay the monitor on a flat surface facing down. Next, we will connect the stand to the monitor. We want to slide the top of the stand at an angle to where the grooves slide in and push downward on the stand to snap the monitor in place. Finally, we will screw the base to the bottom of the stand. For optimal viewing, it is recommended to look at the full face of the monitor, then adjust the monitor's angle to your preference. Hold the stand so the monitor will not topple when you change the monitor's angle. The monitor can be height adjusted 130 millimeters and tilted minus 5 degrees to plus 23 degrees. Note, please do not touch the LCD screen when you change the angle. It may cause damage or break the LCD screen. Next, let's see the ports we have on the monitor. The first three ports are the USB ports. The fourth port is the USB upstream port. We then have two HDMI ports and two display port. Next, we have the audio port. And finally, we have the power cable port. In this example, we will connect via the HDMI port to the monitor and HDMI port to the computer. First, connect the power cable to your monitor and then plug into your nearest wall outlet. Next, we will plug into the monitor's HDMI port and to the HDMI port on the computer. Once we are done connecting the monitor to the computer, we can power on the computer and you will receive video signal to the monitor. Here we're going to go ahead and power the monitor on. To power the monitor off, press the same button. We will quickly go over how to activate the crosshair. To activate the crosshair, press the right arrow. To remove the crosshair, we will press the right arrow once more. In order to activate the USB hub, you must be plugged in via the USB up port to the monitor to the USB A port on your computer. You will use the first three USB ports to connect your peripherals to your computer. In this example, we will connect the mouse to the first USB port on the monitor. Next, we are going to plug into the USB-A port on the laptop. 
Once we connect the USB-A port to the laptop, we're going to test the mouse just to make sure it works. The AOC CU34G2XP monitor can run at 180 Hz, but not all graphics cards are capable. Older or lower end graphics cards may not have the necessary power or features to support such a high refresh rate. It is recommended to check the specs of your graphics card you are considering, ensuring it can handle the 180 Hz. And there you have it. Your AOC gaming monitor is now ready to use. Unleash your potential with AOC gaming monitors.